Section 4 colon 2 Understanding the Volatility Index, VIX, 4.2 Volatility Trading Strategies, Trading strategies that leverage the VIX can include the use of VIX futures, options, and exchange-traded products, ETPs. These strategies aim to profit from changes in the level of implied volatility and can be used by traders and investors to speculate on or hedge against volatility movements. Here are some common trading strategies, VIX futures. VIX futures contracts allow traders to speculate on the future level of the VIX. By taking long or short positions in VIX futures, traders can profit from changes in the expected volatility. If a trader expects the VIX to increase, they may take a long position in VIX futures. Aiming to profit from a rise in volatility. Conversely, if a trader expects the VIX to decline, they may take a short position in VIX futures. It's important to note that VIX futures have an expiration date, and their prices may not necessarily track the spot VIX index perfectly. VIX options. VIX options provide the opportunity to trade volatility directly. Traders can use VIX call or put options to speculate on or hedge against changes in implied volatility. Buying VIX call options allows traders to profit from an increase in the VIX, while buying VIX put options can offer potential gains if the VIX declines. VIX options can also be used for hedging purposes to protect against adverse volatility movements in other portfolio positions. VIX Exchange Traded Products, ETPs There are various exchange traded products that track the VIX or VIX futures, offering investors exposure to volatility movements. These ETPs can be structured as exchange traded funds, ETFs, or exchange traded notes, ETNs. They aim to replicate the performance of the VIX or VIX futures by holding positions in VIX futures contracts. Traders and investors can take long or short positions in these VIX ETPs to speculate on or hedge against volatility changes. However, it's important to note that these ETPs may not perfectly track the spot VIX index due to factors such as contango or backwardation in the futures market, volatility spreads. Traders can also employ volatility spread strategies using VIX futures or options. Volatility spreads involve simultaneously buying and selling VIX futures or options contracts with different expiration dates or strike prices. These strategies aim to profit from the price differences between different contract months or option strikes while taking a position on the expected volatility levels. Popular volatility spread strategies include calendar spreads and diagonal spreads. It's crucial to note that trading VIX related instruments can be complex and carries inherent risks. The VIX is a derivative product, and its behavior can be influenced by various factors such as market contango slash backwardation, liquidity, and time decay. Traders and investors should have a solid understanding of volatility dynamics. Risk management, and the specific characteristics of VIX-related instruments before implementing these strategies. It's advisable to seek professional guidance or conduct thorough research before engaging in VIX trading strategies, there are several strategies that traders can employ to profit from changes in volatility levels. These strategies aim to take advantage of fluctuations in implied volatility and can be used in various financial markets. Here are some common strategies for profiting from changes in volatility levels. Volatility breakout strategy. This strategy involves identifying periods of low volatility and anticipating a breakout or a significant move in price. Traders can use technical indicators such as Bollinger Bands, Average True Range, ATR, or Donkian Channels to identify low volatility periods. Once a breakout occurs, traders can take positions in the direction of the breakout, aiming to profit from the subsequent price movement. Volatility breakouts can occur in any tradable instrument, including stocks, currencies, or commodities. Volatility Mean Reversion Strategy this strategy is based on the assumption that periods of high volatility are followed by a return to average or lower volatility levels. Traders identify extreme levels of volatility, either high or low, and take positions that anticipate a reversion to the mean. For instance, if volatility is unusually high, traders may sell options or volatility-based products. Expecting a decline in volatility as market conditions stabilize. 
Conversely, if volatility is unusually low, traders may buy options or volatility-based products, expecting an increase in volatility, volatility spreads, volatility spreads involve simultaneously buying and selling options or futures contracts with different strike prices or expiration dates. These strategies aim to profit from the price differences between different options or futures contracts. For example, traders can implement a volatility spread by buying options with a higher implied volatility and selling options with a lower implied volatility. Volatility spreads can be constructed using various options or futures strategies, such as calendar spreads, diagonal spreads, or ratio spreads, straddle or strangle strategies. These strategies involve buying both a call and a put option with the same expiration date and strike price, straddle, or different strike prices, strangle. Traders employ straddle or strangle strategies when they expect a significant move in the underlying asset's price but are uncertain about the direction. The strategy aims to profit from a substantial increase in volatility, which can lead to an increase in option prices. If the underlying asset experiences a significant move, the profit potential is maximized, volatility ETFs or ETNs, exchange-traded products, ETFs or ETNs, that track volatility indexes or futures can provide exposure to changes in volatility levels. These products are designed to replicate the performance of the underlying volatility index or futures contracts. Traders can take long or short positions in volatility ETFs or ETNs to capitalize on expected volatility movements. However, it's important to note that these products may not perfectly track the spot VIX index or volatility levels due to factors such as contango or backwardation. It's important to remember that trading strategies involving volatility carry risks, and proper risk management is crucial. Volatility can be unpredictable, and losses can occur if market conditions do not align with expectations. Traders should carefully analyze market conditions, conduct thorough research and consider using appropriate risk management techniques, such as stop-loss orders or position sizing, when implementing strategies to profit from changes in volatility levels.